Hi everybody and welcome. So today I'm going to try something a little bit different. Um, I'm going to start out doing an acrylic painting because um, I want to try to achieve layers. Now with, I don't know what I'm doing, let's just say that <laughs> and let's see what we make today. Okay? Peace. So far what I had down is basically a skeleton of what I want to do. Um, I use my own body as a model a lot of times. I have um, dual mirrors next to me so that when I'm painting I can look over at myself and you know maybe get down into the position that I want the figure to be in. Um, so that's why a lot of times when I'm doing a sketch you'll see me moving around. Um, it's because I'm trying to find the pose. This is going to be like a spiritual gift. <laughs> um, that's what it's about. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to first paint the sketch that I just made in acrylic paint. Then I'm going to let it dry. And then I'm going to come back and paint the figure in with oil and see what kind of effect that makes. <laughs> Okay, and I am going to turn on Jesus Christ Superstar because <laughs> it entertains me so much. So, I'll see you guys in a minute. Bye. Okay, so, as I said, I'm trying something new, I'm experimenting. This is how we grow as artists. We try crazy things that we come up with. So, anyway, what I'm thinking is going to happen with this is I'm going to wait for it to dry, and then I'm going to put oil paint on top of this acrylic that's up. So, my hypothesis is that when I paint over it with the oil paint, it's going to look like an oil painting and just have a different effect altogether. Like, I feel like the acrylic paint is going to come through a little bit. And this way we have the colors blending because the oil paint is a little bit, um, what's the word, transparent. So, you know, that's why when you see an oil painting and the light shines on it, it kind of illuminates a little bit because it's able to reflect back, I think. Please don't quote me. <laughs> so what I'm thinking is going to happen is I'm going to put this acrylic down, which is there already, and um, I think what's going to happen is that the color from the acrylic is going to shine through just a little bit in different ways on different parts of it. So. I'm excited to see if this works because that would be a really hot style. Um, thanks for sitting here and watching me. <laughs> I really appreciate it. I fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I was sitting there and I was concentrating. How do you spell strength? Strength. And I kept on saying it over and over in my head. Strength. And I said, I'm not going to spell this wrong. I'm not going to spell this wrong. And strength. It has an R in there, doesn't it? <laughs> Oops. Okay, that's the beauty of acrylic though, um, because I could just put some acrylic paint over it and nobody will see it, And but this now means that I have to take another 5 or 10 minute break so that the paint could dry again. Great. <laughs> okay, peace out, Joe.
so I finished the painting. Um, I found that doing that acrylic underpainting thing, I mean, the painting is good, but um, it doesn't change the... Um, it looks like an oil painting. I would have been better off starting with oil and ending with oil. You know what I mean? So, it's all done, and you've been listening to Sir Uno. Okay, now subscribe, comment, like, all that good stuff. And um, if you have any interest in the painting that you see behind me, just contact me. <laughs> I'll see you. And again, my name is Liz Marati. L-I-Z-M-A-R-O-T-T-I. Okay? Peace.